I think one of the advantages of being in a situation where you're talking to a bot, not talking to a person, is you can be rude to them. Because quite often when I call up a call centre, I mean, you, you, you're not in a good mood anyway because you have to call up the call centre. And the first thing you get is like a recorded message which says, you know, did you know that you could do things on our website? I'm like, oh my God, no, you have a website. I'd never thought of that. I'm like, this is, I'm lit. This is the last thing I want to do is to actually call you up on the phone. So don't tell me about the website. If, you're, if your rubbish website could do what I wanted to do, I wouldn't be bothered calling you. Anyway, that's not the point. The point is you're quite often in a bad mood and you want to get stuff done. And it can be very therapeutic, you know, if you can sort of yell and shout and swear at the chatbot, I feel bad about doing that to the call centre employees because it's not their, you know, they don't design the systems. You know, there's horrible people on airlines who shout at the stewardess because, the, like, it's anything to do with her that the plane has been diverted or scheduled or whatever. Anyway, the point is, I think an un, there's, an, there's an unseen therapeutic impact of moving to bots, which is that you can be horrible to them. So I wish more companies would do this right away.